Welcome to UvaTech. In this lecture we will learn about the formation of PN junction. Please don't forget to give your feedback after watching this video. We also request you to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon to receive notifications. Let us see how the PN junction formed. When a P-type semiconductor is suitably joined to N-type semiconductor, the contact surface is called PN junction. The PN junction is fabricated by special techniques. One of the common methods of making the PN junction is called alloying. The formation of PN junction brings the popular device called semiconductor diode. Let us consider first the features of unbiased PN junction. If the doping levels are not uniform, then at one place, large number of charge carriers exist, and at another place small number of charge carriers exist. In a high charge carrier concentration area, all the charge carriers are of similar type. They may be either electrons or holes. They will start repelling each other. Due to this action, charge carriers start moving from high concentration area to low concentration area to achieve uniform concentration all over the material. This process is called diffusion and exists when there is non-uniform concentration of charge carriers in the material. In a PN junction, on N side, there are large number of electrons, while on P side electrons are minority in number. Hence the diffusion starts and electron starts moving from N side to P side. It is called electron diffusion. Similarly hole diffusion takes place from P type to N type semiconductor. In the next lecture, we will see what is barrier potential in the depletion layer. Thank you.